How to replace the thermal paste in a laptop. Today, let's replace the thermal paste on the MSI MS 16W2 laptop, as our followers have requested. Get ready to revitalize your laptop by reducing your CPU's temperature by 16 degrees Celsius in just 6 easy steps. Step 1, get tools ready. Many tools are needed to replace the laptop's thermal paste. Apart from the thermal paste and thermal paste cleaning wipes, some gadgets can help you to disassemble the laptop much more easily. If you don't want to buy them separately, you can find our total solution combo in our profile. Step 2, remove the laptop case and battery. Before disassembling the computer, it is strongly recommended to wash your hands or wear gloves and an anti-static wristband to eliminate static electricity. With the back of the laptop facing up, use a PH0 screwdriver to remove all the screws on the bottom cover, a total of 12. Prepare a triangular pry piece and a pry bar. Insert the triangular pry piece from the corner and slide around to open the bottom cover. After opening the bottom cover, use two pry bars to pull out the power cord. Press against both sides of the connector and push outward to remove it. After removing the power, remember to hold down the power button for 15 seconds to discharge. Step 3, remove the heatsink and old thermal paste. First, use two pry bars to remove the power cords on both sides of the fan. Then use a crowbar to open the ZIF connector. Unplug the motherboard cable. Use tweezers to pick out the ribbon cable. When removing screws, choose a high quality screwdriver like the Cooling Monster Combo 01. When screwing, keep the screwdriver perpendicular to the plane and apply pressure to avoid stripping the screws. After removing the 12 screws, hold the fans on both sides and lift up the entire cooling module. Next, clean off the dried thermal paste on the cooling module. To clean the old thermal paste more efficiently, we recommend using Cooling Monster Clean 01 Thermal Paste Cleaning Wipes. If you're worried about getting your hands dirty, you can use the disposable gloves included in our kit. Here you can see, the thermal paste on the processor has dried up after years of use, reducing its cooling efficiency. It needs timely replacement. Step 4, Clean the Fan. Use a PH000 screwdriver to remove the screws on both sides of the fan, four on the right and three on the left, a total of seven. Remove the fans and use an anti-static brush and compressed air to clean the dust on the fan blades. Use compressed air from a distance to avoid liquid spraying out. Next, clean the dust left in the cooling module's exhaust port, and then use an anti-static brush to brush off the dust on the back panel. Using compressed air can clean the details and significantly improve efficiency. Next, reinstall the fans and screw back the seven screws. Step 5, apply thermal paste. Here we used Cooling Monster Cold 01 High Performance Thermal Paste. Apply an appropriate amount of thermal paste on the surfaces of the CPU and GPU. After applying the thermal paste, you can use the spatula to evenly spread out the thermal paste and remove the excess. You can also use the P-Size method if you like. Step 6, reassemble your laptop. 
Next, align the entire cooling module with the screw holes, put it back on the motherboard. Use a PH0 model screwdriver to tighten the 12 screws. Plug back the power cord, fan cable, and motherboard ribbon cable. Fasten the ZIF connector, plug back the power cord. Cover the back of the laptop and secure the clips. You can power up the laptop first to see if it is running normally. Finally, screw back the 12 screws on the back cover, and you are done. Follow and subscribe to Cooling Monster and let us know which laptops to demo this process with next.